It was around 1, 40, 2 o'clock. We were walking down the street, an uh, empty street. We were just walking down, minding our own business. We're both headed home, and the officer is approaching us, and as he pulled up on the side of us, he didn't say freeze, hope, or nothing like we were committing a crime. He said, get the F on the sidewalk. I told the officer we were not but a minute away from the destination. He's at an angle where we're so close to his door and him that when he tries to thrust the door open aggressively, it doesn't come an inch out before it strikes both of us. Uh, arm extended out the window, grabbed my friend around the neck. He didn't say step back or anything like that. He started to pull my friend into the window. So the officer's trying to pull him in and he's pulling away from the officer. He never once attempted to grab for this officer's weapon. He's still holding my friend with one arm and now with the other hand, he's pointing his weapon. The second time he says, I'll shoot, it wasn't even a second later before the gun just went off and the officer let go. And that's how we were able to run at the same time. The first car I see, I duck behind for cover because I fear for my life. I'm scared. I don't know what's going on. I don't understand why this officer is shooting his weapon at us. And I'm looking, I'm watching the officer. He's pursuing my friend now that he fired another shot. It struck my friend in the back. Then my friend stopped running. His hands immediately went in the air and he turned around towards the officer face to face. He started to tell the officer that he was unarmed and that you should stop shooting me. Before he can get his second sentence out, the officer fired seven more shots into his head and chest area. And he fell dramatically in a fatal position. I did not hear once he yelled, freeze, stop, or hope. It was just horrible to watch. <laughs> it hurt him a lot. I see it in his eyes, it hurt him a lot. It was definitely like being shot like an animal. It was almost like putting someone to execution. He was a peaceful person and he lived his life peaceful. I definitely think he's guilty of murder.